up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode two of Phoenix Rising. Last time we were in the excitement of this game finally coming out, we introduced ourselves and said that we are a PG tuber, not a cringy tuber, and we do like to take our time and explore everything that the game has to offer. And then we got ourselves our starter here, which you can see who is next to us. Who's gonna say what? Emily spun around in a circle. And in today's episode, we're finally going to get started exploring somewhere because we really should have done that in the last episode. But anyway, if you enjoy Phoenix Rising, hit the thumbs up down below. Um, take a guess at our uh, our little Who's That Pokemon that we have going on. We'll talk about that as the episode gets going, I'm sure. Um, and subscribe if you're new. Click the little bell thingy-mabobber that's on there so YouTube will actually show you our videos. And let's go ahead and get to it. Now I did, I did actually restart, completely restarted the game because I looked at Emily and Emily was an adamant nature and I know that this is just a, a demo and it's just a, you know, probably not going to be the most difficult of games, but I didn't want just a bad nature, which adamant nature on a star you would be bad. So instead our Emily is hardy nature with tackle water gun and harden. That's our team for now. Now, I think I'm supposed to, like, hang around here or something. Can I leave? Professor Lotus has a habit of leaving me, uh, in charge. Hey, are you leaving? I thought... I thought you're gonna help me explain the situation to Lotus, right? Thank you for waiting with me, I really appreciate the support. Professor Lotus is so talented, but she's also a little scary, right? Maybe you don't think that since you've known her for so long, sorry. You know that I really respect her, right? I wasn't like trash talking her, I swear. She's an incredible scientist, researcher, but her standards are crazy, you know? This is really awkward. You can go, no hard feelings, I'll explain to Lotus. I'll see you later though, and this is really great, yeah? Yeah, have fun. Objective complete. Visit the lab. I really... Wait, 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 wait. There was a not empty trash can here. Okay. Anyway. Um, I wanted to look again at our journal. So, a, de a lesson in destiny. Objectives bring the tea bags. <sighs> Back to the Soothsayer, Life Like a Lotus, Meet Lotus in Tranquilo, we got Side Quest, Pokey Hunts, that sounds really cool, like we're gonna have to hunt down certain Pokemon, that's really cool. So as we jump in, as we start doing stuff, let me know, what do you think about our layout, what do you think about the, um, the whole changes that we've made uh, the new stuff what do you think about the um the who's that pokemon what do you think about the intro those are two things that i actually made all on my own which i was really proud with them but uh let me know what you think that's the most important thing but let's go ahead and deliver these tea bags back here now that we have our little star you oh domino you've returned i'm glad did you hear very much of that? Did you hear very much of that when you entered the room? I know you have witnessed me experience the visions before, yes? The premonition which passed was very powerful. I feel sapped of energy. The glimpses of death, darkness, rabid flames engulfing Nocturne Town. Such an ill-omened vision is rare, but one cannot succumb to hysteria. To fixate on the end of the world, it would make it impossible to live fully one's life. Let us drink. Tea is a fine remedy for such stresses. Tell you, Domino, tell you, to you, Domino, in our future travels. May you find success everlasting. Pretend that this is tea. Pinky out. That was very nice, Domino. Thank you. I feel completely refreshed. And be sure to thank your mother for me again. It was tea. It was good tea, yes? Now, final piece of advice. Should you ever question your path, please return here. I shall put on a kettle and perhaps a vision will grace me. But surely together we can help you to ascertain your next step. Keep up with your studies, train your Pokemon well, and I'm sure I shall see you soon. Objective complete! 
A lesson in destiny complete. I don't think a lesson in destiny is complete just yet. Oh, okay, yeah, it is. All right. So now I think we head off to Route 1. But let's stop and talk to Mom real quick. <laughs> uh, I didn't want to record again while I was sick. But I wanted to play this game. So, it is what it is. All right, let's talk to Mom again. Tranquilo Town isn't that far from here. You know this, though. We sit, we've been plenty of times since you were a child. Just head east and follow the path. You'll be safe with your Pokemon. Come back if you'd like to take a rest and heal your Pokemon. You know what I realized? We didn't go upstairs. We didn't even go to our room. And of course, of course, we have a potion on the bed. This better not be my room. Where am my room at? This my room. With this bigger TV. Actually, I don't watch TV. So. Alright. Let's get to it. Route numero... Just look at how pretty this is. Alright, I want to see a battle screen. And hear the battle music. A cutie fly. Ooh, look at this. Stats. Oh, so it's like the bottom screen on... Okay, I see you. I see you. Fight, bag, party, run. I'm gonna fight and I'm gonna go for water gun. Oh, you have absorb. Oh, that didn't do anything. Let's just go for tackle. Oh, look at that. You have a potion. Right, what else can we find around here? A sentry. That's exciting. Actually, you know what? I bet I can pull up Pokemon Go right now. And we'll find a centric. Not sponsored, but kind of sponsored. Don't think too much into that. Not sponsored. Not sponsored. Uh, I bet I can pull a Pokemon Go right now. All right, one more. I bet I can. I bet there's a centric right now. There's not a centric right now. I was wrong. Ooh, there's, oh, oh, look, look at it. Look at it. I told you there was a Sentret and that Charmander just disappeared. And now I'm a little upset. Learned Astonish. Hold on, I gotta, I have to do some, I have to check and see if any of these, any of these are shiny. Hold on. Get that Charmander to pop back up. If that was a shiny Charmander and I just missed out on it, I'm going to be so upset. No, stop. All right. I've got to head out. I know I do. All right. I'm focused. All right. Here we go. Into Route 1. No more pointless battles. We're going to run from the next one. Even though this is level 4, so it would be good. Let's head on. Let's head on. We gotta... You know, we talked about being okay with, uh... We talked about being okay with... Taking a couple extra episodes to do things. But... We don't just want to lollygag around. I will definitely take an Orenberry. Ooh, a Pidgey. Nice. I'm actually in Pokemon Go. Speaking of Pokemon Go, now that I started talking about it, I'm never gonna stop. Uh, but I started catching all the Pidgeys again. Y your Pokemon are hurt, are they? You can heal them at a Pokemon Center. It's the building with the orange roof. Okay, sure. Uh, which way? I'm gonna guess because she just said that the right way to go is that way. Okay, so far this music hasn't gotten annoying. That's good. Encounter rate's kind of high. Not gonna lie. I wonder if there's shiny Pokemon here. I love being near the sea. The beach here is very small, but Salt Tempo City is too far away for me. I hear they have a, an amazing beach there. Maybe someday. Found a potion. Cool. That makes it all worth it. What's this? You can register an item by pressing A, S, or D while viewing it in your bag. Okay. 
A, S, or D. Got it. What should we add to the team once we can? I don't think I've seen anything so far that I want to add. We're going to try and be sparing with what we add to the team. Only going to add the finest of Pokemons. Encounter rate is way too high. Are we already in Tranquilo Town? We are. Oh my goodness. Again, I love that title. <laughs> ah! Ooh. Get to work, Chansey. That's right. Hmm. A standard but uninteresting assortment. Greetings. I'm experienced book uh, bookshelf critic. Books are a piece of art. Don't take them for granted. Okay. I'm telling you, I saw it. Never in all my travels have I seen a, such a Pokemon in a farm. Well, you should have looked harder because I seen one. Well, you should have looked harder because I seen one. What? Hey, kid. Come talk with me for a moment. Still waiting for that Charmander to pop up. This guy doesn't believe me when I say there's a bona fide fighting Pokemon in Trad Farm. You're a trainer, right? If you manage to catch one of them and show my friend here, I'll give you something good. What a waste of time. I guess if you got nothing better to do, prove me wrong. Good luck, kid. That's a side quest. This must be one of the Pokemon... Poke Hunt. Nope. I guess that's just a side mission. Okay. So my goal is to catch one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, thanks. Like, it's so hot in these here overall. That's why I love Pokemon Centers. Okay, let's check out the PC. Nice PC. All right. Charmander! He's like three steps north of where I'm standing. It is dark. Why is it so dark? You're a new trainer, huh? Yeah, I can see it in your eyes. Check out Trad Farm. A visit I found him! He's not shiny, though. Wait. He almost looked shiny there, didn't he? I gotta catch him. Hold on. I gotta catch all Charmanders. My favorite Pokemon right there. A visit there might be just what you need. I gotta repel. Should I use repels? I think I should start using repels. I'm not a huge fan of repels, but... Do I happen to know Professor Lotus? No. Okay, apparently I do. Really? Well, here's a bit of gossip. I would babysit Professor Lotus when she was a child. Interesting, right? She has loved Pokemon for as long as I've known her. She never slept very well, but she loved to cuddle with my Sentret. Cute, right? Now, she's a professional, but we see each other from time to time. I thought there was going to be more to it than that. I really thought there was going to be more to that than that. I just love the country air. It's better than any medicine I've ever taken. Okay, it's intentionally getting darker. You can't convince me otherwise. Like, is there a day-night cycle as you play the game? That'd be pretty cool. I just... Everybody wants to be proud of their family members. My grandson is supposedly a powerful trainer, inspiring everybody he meets. And his grandmother, I simply remember him as the... As his grandmother, I simply remember him as a spiritly young child who would help me tend crops and ask the most adorable questions. Thank you for listening. Use this. Blah, blah, blah. My brother idolizes her older... My daughter idolizes her older brother, all because he's a trainer. I can't read! She knows that I train Pokemon too, but I suppose farming Pokemon aren't hip. Okay, I got a love ball, so I can't be super upset with that place. Oh, I can't get down to the mill tank. So instead, we head up this way. What's going on up here? Oh, how do these crazy stones work? Oh, I'm very glad you asked that kind, sir. My evolutionary gems work by magic. Magic? I don't believe in magic. It's the magic of evolution, my friend. Give one of my gems to your Pokemon. Watch it evolve before your very eyes. Instantly, your Pokemon will be stronger. 
Can they evolve any Pokemon, mister? Any and every Pokemon. Oh! Get him! Get him! Citizens of Tranquilo Town. This man is a fraud. His wares are counterfeit. A fraud, but he sold us all this stuff. None of it is real. Now, let's not rush to conclusions, folks. I am but a humble salesman. A small business owner to think that I would rob you sweet, kind people. You who took me in. You who invited me into your homes. Why, what a manner of mon what manner of monster would reward such graciousness with deceit? That I, certainly, I speak no lies. However, who is this woman, huh? Maybe she is the fraud here. On what authority does she claim that I'm a fake? Oh, well, this is Professor Lotus. She studies at Trinita University. Wow, a Pokemon professor? She's gotta know what she's talking about. Yeah, and where'd this guy even come from? I th I thought you knew, don't you? No, I thought you were the one who knew him. Who is he? As if I know, all I know is that he sold us all this junk. This is junk that you sold us. Yeah, it looks like junk. I want my money back. Yeah, we all deserve a refund. A refund? Wait. You want me to give you money? The boy straight up disappeared. Where'd he go? He disappeared. There's no trace of him or our money. Hey, let me through. Let me through. I'm important. All right, thanks. Hello, Domino. I noticed you in the crowd watching. Stunning events, really. Such a simple situation, but a dramatic turn. Her voice will get so much better when I'm not sick. Now, did you come all the way to search me out in Tranquilo Town? That's very brave. I apologize for the delays experience here. The, co the, co uh, blah, the conflict at hand escalated in unexpected ways. Although it seems that Tim was happy to handle the issue himself. I have a lecture in mind about protocol for when I see him next. He persuaded you to star you, I see. Certainly a versatile Pokemon. Moreover, their evolution is known for their high, spe high speed statistic. Domino, this is the farmer. This is Farmer Terrence. He is the owner of Trad Farm. His milk tank herd produces most of the Moo Moo milk for the region. Hi there! Sorry we had to meet under these trying circumstances. As you witnessed, the people of Tranquilla Town have been tricked. Yes, indeed. That man wandered into town about three days ago. We were all planning for the festival, so we ain't got much in going on. But he seemed all right, kind, curious, kind, courteous, kept to himself. He told us about these here stones that he'd be selling, magic stones. More specifically, stones used towards the purpose of Pokemon evolution. Terrence and I have been colleagues for many years with his farm. <clears throat> he was therefore familiar with my work regarding artifacts and mythology. The festival arrived and our man's magic stones sold well, obviously. Terrence, Terrence was suspicious of the man's quick turnaround and called me. And you saw the results of the competition we had planned. Perhaps we had not been so cavalier about this. Speaking of cavaliers... Woo! 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 Now, I don't know when this video is going up. I am recording it before game six. But if the Celtics win. But if the Celtics... But if the Celtics win. Yeah, I'm getting right up there. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. If they lose, <laughs> I'm gonna cut this out. All right, uh, <laughs> Professor Lotus, you'll find I have the utmost faith in you. Hold on, hold on. Okay, hold, hold the phone, just one second. Oh, now we good. You're the most talented doctor I ever met, Professor Lotus. You stopped that varmint from stealing everyone, anyone else's wages. I don't know if we'd be it where we'd be if you hadn't come to rescue us. I love you, Professor Lotus. And she's like, Domino, we need to get out of here. Will you help me, please? We need to talk before you depart for Trinita. This is very important, but I need help. But I need to help search for the swindler. While we search, I would recommend your tr training your Pokemon at Trad Farm. Trainers from my farm. Trainers from my farm are always raring for a Pokemon battle. It might be good for you, Domino. I will find you as soon as I can. Bro, wait, where's she going? Oh, maybe he was like, I love you, and she was like, same. 
All right, we have met Professor Lotus in Tranquilo Town. And now we have a new mission. No, Life Like a Lotus is complete. See, this is one thing I don't like about this game. This is the only thing that I have so far. So far, it's been a really cool game. But I can't do anything during this. It's really slow. And I know that's not because of my computer. My computer's a monster. Okay. So, but you see like how smooth this is? It's weird. Swindler shenanigans. Explore Trad Farm. Okay. Easy enough. Trad Farm. Let's check out the Pokemon first. Woo! Alright, here we go. These amazing stands always have different wares. I've seen some outrageous stuff in some of these. Who this? She looks important. I can't wait to try out new outfits. Hey, same. The Pokemon at Trad Farm used to be too tough for my team to handle, so I stocked up on potions here. I'm out of money, but now nothing can beat me. Pokemon centers are fine and well, but they don't help you out in the field, you know? I like... Oh, did I just miss... I just missed out on a Premier Ball because I'm an idiot. Alright, what's this travel pack? Everything a traveler should need on their long journeys in Hawthorne. Consumable travel pack used for one fast travel trip. Well, that's cool. Alright, I'm good. I'm good for now. For now. Is this an elevator? I mean, obviously that's an elevator, but... Alright, that's a fast travel thing. There's a rare fighting type Pokemon in Trad Farm. Of course, I've never seen it. Maybe it's made up. I wonder what it is. I have nothing to go off of what it could potentially be. Are you familiar with PowerPoint? Yes. I found an ether. Thanks. Hey! Who said you could take that? Just kidding. I'm the PP guy. Everybody knows it. Forget I said that. I like that they have mature humor. He said, I'm the PP guy. Two Petcha Berries. Give me them. Two Petcha Berries. Give me them. Oh, a tractor broke down, so I can't go through. Okay. Is it conveniently going to be done by the time I come back? Alright, let's hit it up. Who this guy? I heard some gatehouses have shops in them, so I came here. Not this one, it seems. Gatehouses? I love movies. When I grow up, I want to be a movie. Wait, what? The Shiny, the Pyro King, Self-Destruct Squad. Further here is Trad Farm. Beyond that is, well, mostly water, I think. Whee! Wait, why would you say Fwee? Press the Z key to speed up battles. If you find yourself wanting to speed up a battle, press Z to speed it up or slow it down. Sign this game up for the best fan-made game of all time. Okay, I see you. That was the Ultra Sun. This is all Ultra Sun and Moon. <laughs> Good memories. Good memories. I loved Ultra Sun and Moon. I don't care what anyone else thought about the game. I loved Ultra Sun and Moon. Send out your Pidgey. I ain't scared of nothing. I ain't scared of your Pidge Pidge. Pidge Pidge. Alright, your Pidge Pidge did a little bit of damage to me. Don't appreciate that. Look at that screen. Is that not awesome? Era 
Lies Heal. What's this? This here silos for storing grain. Don't go playing in it, you hear? Oh, I'm playing in it. Oh. Time to get up. Is this the one they're talking about? I'm not using a Ludicolo. I'm not using a Lucario. I love how fast that animation was. I love how fast that ball animation is. I'm not using a Riolu, a Lucario. No, 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 no. Yes, I would like to give a nickname to it, even though it takes an hour and a half. That's his nickname. His nickname is Overrated. Uh... I guess add him to the party, just in case someone is like, Oh, have you seen this, this, this and that? And that is why... That is why I, uh... Whatever I was trying to say. I don't, I don't have a clue where I, where I was trying to go with that. I've never used a star you, star me. I, I like, I like some of these details that we're getting so far. On a list of, also the battle background here is really good too. It's really nice. That's one thing I really like about the, well, all Pokemon games really, is just seeing the new background, seeing the new artwork, just everything like that. He said, don't step in the mud. I'm gonna push you in the mud. How about that? Camper Ted, you and your mill tank. Hey, don't use rollout. Let's tackle. Whoa. See how fast that is, though? It's like it suggests what item you should use. That's really cool. Rapid spin? Uh, I'm not going to use rapid spin. This isn't competitive. This isn't competitive. Even if it was competitive, you'd have to convince me to use it. Alright, we're going to wrap up here shortly. I really wanted to see if I could... Actually, you know what I should do? I should go back to the Pokemon Center and talk to those guys. Uh, that we're talking about this fighting Pokemon and finish this side quest real quick. In fact, I quite like that. I quite like that idea. So let's do just that. The transitions when you walk out of a door, a little slow right now, and Tranquilo Town is very laggy. I'm not quite sure why. But, overall, I'm really liking this game. Um, I'm going to probably take a couple days off of playing the next episode, just so I can <clears throat> not be sick. And actually have good voices and not be coughing all the time. You found one! Sweet! Show my pal here and give me a right chuckle. You found one! Ha! I knew it! Nice job, kid. Take this. False swipe! Okay. Now, 
I'm sure everyone will be using this guy. And I just, you know, Pokemon, uh, or Pokken, Pokken Tournament totally ruined Lucario for me. I was never a big fan before, but he totally, no. Nope. Nope. All right. That's where we're going to wrap up today's episode. Right there. We are in the Trad Farm. <laughs> I'm, I'm really liking this game for a lot of reasons. I'm liking this game for a lot of reasons. Um, it's a beautiful game. Obviously, we knew that was going to be the case. It's got speed up buttons. It's got a forever on run. <clears throat> it's got speed up buttons in battles. The encounter rate is pretty high. It's a little laggy in some areas, but this is the first demo. I'm not complaining by any means. Just simply stating things. Um, in the next episode, we're going to explore the rest of Trad Farm. I don't know where we go from there, so you'll have to come back and find out. If you enjoyed this episode, hit the thumbs up down below. Uh, make sure you've subscribed. Make sure you hit the little bell icon thing so you get notified of all our videos because YouTube doesn't think that if you subscribe, that means you want to see the videos, so help them out there. And uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Make sure you check out the end screen to see if your Who's That Pokemon was correct. But we'll see you in the next episode. Until then, spread some positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.